Hi there, I'm Abhishek Inamdar from Keyframes Online. Today's topic is how to give a printout from 3D Max itself. Uh, that is, uh, not we can do that uh, like Control P and it will get printed out by the printer. But still, there are some very good ways to do that. Uh, so let's get started. I'll go to render, uh, rendering uh, menu, and uh, there is a print size assistant. So if you click on print size assistant, you will see that print size wizard, uh, lizard, not wizard. It's a wizard. <laughs> so cool. So so here uh, we can see there are a lot of papers. Uh, paper size are there. And for example, I want uh, my this uh, structure to be print out on uh, A4 size not A3 size because it's too large for right now so of course if you want you can take any size of that and I can say A4 size and see how it has been fitted on this uh, small thing and uh, this is the DPI that is dot per inch of the pixel so if you are going for a same uh, size like A4 we can go 300 and if the image is uh, blowing up for example I'm taking a printout on A3 size and it will be going going to print on larger scale or a hoarding or something like that so you can go and switch it to 600 so this is the what the file size it's showing it's KB it's on it's on KB so if you click on 300 it is 22125480 KB and if you click on 600 it is almost almost double so this is what is and uh, this is the paper width and height so and this is the uh, image width and height so these are two different things and if you want in portrait it can be done in portrait and landscape as well so the files if you want to save that file in particular location of your hard disk or your hard drive you can save files and it will be get are saved to that and if you say compress file that will be compressed as a TIFF format compression and uh, it will be saved so now the same render setting can be followed through our render setup if you click on render setup it will not render but it will go to the render setup and it will change the width and height what we have decided to do for example if I have clicked on this uh, the render setting will be taken by this and uh, it has not been changed so in this if you go on say print size assistant and say I want print out in A4 it is all has been changed in render setup is as well so for that uh, I'll pause my video because it will take too long time to render in my uh, very small machine so I'll just pause my video and I'll show you right away what I get so welcome back uh, I just paused my video and uh, just to see the what the quality is coming it's very coming crisp quality to give the printout and uh, so this is what uh, I want to show you in this tutorial and if you liked my tutorial do subscribe my channel that is keyframes online and uh, thanks for watching my tutorial um, thank you